All right, so this is a 1998 ZL 440 with a 500 motor in it. So it's not a 440 fan or liquid. It's a 500 Suzuki Twin from 98, 2000 era, non-powerful valve. Uh, pretty good shape cosmetically. Uh, it has brand new carbides on the skis. Hood is pretty good overall. It has one crack here. And the guy had bolted that on. But overall, really, really decent condition. Uh, skis, A-arms, all that, pretty decent. Skid is pretty good overall. But the shock is shot, so that's not good. Um, rear bumper, it's okay. It's got a little hairline here, crack there, a little crack starting there. Not perfect. Seat, it's actually really good condition, nice and soft yet. But the, uh, there's one rip back there. There's no mice in it or anything like that. Kind of looks like this thing. I don't know. It probably is an OEM cover from what it looks of it. Got aftermarket. Fuel gauge on it. It's good shape. Uh, cover is actually really good shape. It's got... 6600 on the chassis uh, previous owner did check the abdominer of the other sled it was at about 2500 so motor itself only has about 2500 miles uh, I suppose I can show you that here so the reason he's part he didn't want to deal with it was a uh, water pump on the front of the motor is actually leaking but that was the only problem with it it uh, runs and drives just normal Primary clutch is in good shape. I'm trying to think if there's anything else I could talk about. I guess I didn't check the front shocks. That one has some life left in it. This one's pretty much gone. So I suppose it makes sense. The chassis is a bit bit used compared to the motor. So probably been through a couple sets of shocks. Brakes weren't good. Uh, I'm trying to think if there's anything else. Hand warmers, the previous owner said the hand warmers did work, so those are all good to go. I can't really run it long enough to test that. The coolant leak, but I can run it around just a little bit for you. RPM does go down when it's idling. It just kind of takes a second to get into that level. Uh, smoke's good. Uh, carbs actually are really decent. They don't leak fuel or anything like that when it's sitting, so carburetors are good to go. Um, yeah, that's pretty much all I got for you. It's really... The track is in pretty decent shape. It is stock, though, so... It's not a uh, paddle track or anything fancy like that. So I guess that's pretty much all I can tell you. If you have any questions, let me in the comments. Otherwise, have a good one.